I couldn't find my arrow. Got lost in the water, but I had blood through this frag. Let's try to find it here. This is where I saw this tree right here. The frag was shaking. There is red. Here he is, my 2023 uh, archery stag. I'm really excited about this. Made a heck of a shot at 38 yards, and I just, I'm so pumped. I had um, a spike come in earlier in the morning, and then um, I heard some splashing behind me, and I caught movement, and there was two hinds being chased by two different stags, this guy and a spike. And they, were, they came in to about 35 yards, and it started kind of easing slightly away, and I made a 38 yard shot. <laughs> And I just, I'm really excited. So thankful for the opportunity to come down here and hunt Sika deer on the eastern shore for the residents down here. And just, you know, it's, they're always so welcoming and uh, thankful that my wife and family just gave me the opportunity to come out and do this. That's what I love to do. Ever since uh, my good buddy Jared and uh, a buddy, Kurt, uh, exposed me to these Sika deer probably five or six years ago, I've been hooked. And I, I can't see uh, a fall going by without at least chasing these things once or twice. Um, today's the 17th, and two days the inline muzzleloader season comes in, so may come back down here and uh, try to make something happen with that as well. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the footage, and hope you guys are enjoying the fall so far. Have a good day. Second bag deboned, skinned out, ready to pack. <laughs> 